I'm gonna start hating me now. Ah, uh, oh. Hi guys, let me just first address, yes I know, my makeup is different, my clothes, my hair, everything about me is different right now than what you're going to see in the video, and that is because for whatever reason, the first clips that I took of this video originally just wouldn't import into my laptop. I don't know why. I tried everything. And it just wouldn't work. And you know what? Technical difficulties. It happens. Whatever. And I was not about to film this whole thing over again because, again, it's just the first clips. It was just the intro and the first lip product that I mentioned. So um, this first part will be different. But let's get to it. <laughs> I will be sharing with you guys my favorite lip products for spring. I know everyone has their own preference. I know a lot of you like to do mattes for fall and winter and then do more of a glossy lip for spring and summer. Me personally, my preference is matte all year long and you know, it doesn't matter if it's spring, summer, fall, winter, I will do mattes all year long. If you are more of a glossy person for spring, you can most definitely just put a clear gloss over any of these products and you'll be just great. So let's get right into that. First one, this is like my ultimate favorite gloss of all time, all time, all time favorite. This is the NYX Butter Gloss in Creme Brulee. It is the perfect everyday gloss. It's not completely nude. It has like a pinkish um, color to it. Usually I do apply this over another lip product, like a lipstick or something. Right now I just have um, chapstick on. I just want to show you how it looks like by itself. But this is perfect for by itself, perfect for layering on top of other stuff and I just like it for every day. The name Butter Gloss, it literally feels like butter on your lips. Like I can't say much to it, like it just feels amazing and it looks amazing. Here it is color mates and I believe I got this either at the dollar store or big lots one of those stores but it's good for the price it's this lipstick and it's a very pretty like corally like peachy and it is in the shade peach fuzz perfect perfect for spring This one is from Milani and it is in Naturally Chic. This one's another one of like perfect everyday lip when you just feel like doing minimal makeup but this adds like the perfect tint of color to your lips. This color, I don't know how to describe it. I guess it's just, uh, I guess you can say it has like maybe like a little bit like mauve-ness. I don't know, I'm not too sure how to describe it, but it's beautiful. Also, what I've tried out with this lip is um, not putting it on like completely like that, but I just like kind of like dab it like this, and then with my finger, I like rub it in. It looks like if you just like freshly ate like a popsicle and it just leaves like your lips like with that natural like color, like that's what I like to do with this lipstick as well sometimes. But again, if you are more of a glossy type of person for spring and summer, you can definitely just put a clear gloss over it and you'll be perfect. My next one is from Bare Minerals and it is my matte lip in Kissy Face. This one I actually used in my previous video, the um, Fluttershy inspired makeup. So go watch it if you haven't yet. <laughs> 
I can't say very much to it other than the fact that it's just the perfect baby pink, perfect for spring, and it lasts all day. from Maybelline and this is the Superstay Matte Ink in Dreamer. These guys, no joke, it is long lasting. Literally will last you all day, all night. It is kiss proof, uh, drink proof, everything. Like these things are the real deal. And they're affordable, like that's the best part. This pink is definitely more of a bubblegum pink. It's not as light as the previous one from Bare Minerals. It's still perfect, like this is like Springtime, sometimes I feel like wearing more baby pink, sometimes I want more of like a bubble pink, and this one is perfect. so just bear with me. <laughs> the next one is from NYX and this is the Soft Matte Lip Cream in Milan. This one is definitely more of like a darker pink than the previous two that I was showing you guys. I don't want to say it's completely like a fuchsia pink but it is a darker pink. Finally, it is another one from NYX. It is the NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick in Run the World. This one is definitely a bold lip. The other ones are perfect for every day. You can wear them, no problem. This one is for those of you who like a bold lip, and I at times do want to get out of my comfort zone, and this is perfect. actually perfect for all year round. I think this could definitely be worn in fall around like Halloween. Yeah, it's a good color for anything then. <laughs> Alright guys, that was all for this video. I really hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite and also share with me your favorite lip products for spring. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!